Oh, let's, before we, did we talk about the Mobile Hunter Expo? I don't think we did, did we? I don't think we talked about the block. We talked about we're no. going to talk, but we didn't talk yeah. about it. So, that's, they added Sunday to that uh, show, everybody. Um, I know that's something that, I think uh, the original agenda, there wasn't a Sunday time slot, but there is now. And it's in Kalamazoo, Michigan. So, I know a lot of folks are from Michigan. Uh, yeah, it's going to be a great get together. I mean, I'm hoping a lot of people come out, hang out, and you know, yep. get to know some of our fan base. You know, we'll, we'll be there. We're all like all, family, right? Yep, we'll be there all. Oh yeah, for sure. Uh, we'll be there all the all weekend. Um, I think Friday we're doing like a Q and A with a panel, and then Saturday we're doing a, a live show, uh, probably a Q and A. So as long as the internet's working well, there we'll have we'll be on here on that Saturday. You guys can watch it live if you can't get out to it. Um, but yeah, it's a very specific show for mobile hunters, obviously. So um, it's not like your typical deer show where there's all kinds of crazy stuff there. It's all mobile hunting gear, it seems like, or, or things that are related to that. You're going to have your shirts and stuff there, right, Dan? Yes. I'm yeah, I have, have some. Uh, um, some shirts that aren't listed on my site yet. Uh, Army Green, let's say Hunting Beast. You've probably seen... Uh, me and uh, um, Eric wearing them quite a bit. Even you wear them every now and then. Um, I like bought that. a bunch and then they sold out at like uh, the last uh, deer show we went to. So I got a bunch yeah. of those. And after the show, if I have any left over, I'll sell them here too. I got hoodies and all that kind of stuff too. And I think you got some stuff too, right? Yep, I have some we'll green, have green hoodies and a t-shirt as well. Same well, story. I think I, if I don't sell them all this time, I'm going to sell them to the public them somehow on. yeah um i uh we'll have a uh, beast gear there too um we should have stands there we plan on it mm -hmm. um and uh, uh first come first serve so you might want to if you're looking to buy one there get there early yeah um and uh we'll have beast gear shirts and hats and stuff like that too mm -hmm. mario's going the elusive yeah, Mario, Mario will be there. People yeah, could ask him where he's at. Everybody's he's asking. He's at Kalamazoo. He's at. <laughs> yeah. He seems uh, fired up about it. He's been talking to me about it. So yeah, he talked he texted me about it today, actually. Nothing. I I uh I, I text him, I asked him him about how many people he thought would if he'd heard how many people would be there, just so I know how many shirts to bring or what to expect. Mm -hmm. Essentially, I didn't I didn't want to buy, you know, two thousand dollars worth of crap and only sell four hundred dollars worth of it, you know, something like that. But yeah, I think it's going to be a small show. But yeah, that actually gives us a little time to actually talk to yeah. people a little more. Yeah, you know, when it yeah. gets busy, it's hard to to you know talk too long because there's other people waiting and, and stuff. But yeah, those uh those big shows they are a little bit overwhelming with with the amount of people that I mean I'll have people I had people at uh, Wisconsin like text me during the day and or message me on Facebook and say. Hey, I, I kind of was waiting around and I had to go and didn't get to talk to you. Just wanted to say hi and thanks. And I'm like, dang, that sucks, you know, that you didn't get to come up to us. Um, yeah, I know. If you want to watch another video, click right here. But don't forget to subscribe before you leave.